ecosystem structure and function every ecosystem shows three important aspects they are a physical structure interaction of abiotic and biotic components result in a physical structure that is characteristic for each type of ecosystem b species composition identification and enumeration of plant and animal species of an ecosystem gives its species composition c stratification vertical distribution of different species occupying different levels is called stratification for example in a forest trees occupy top vertical layer or strata while shrubs and herbs occupy the bottom layers the structure of ecosystem shows two main components namely biotic and abiotic components you studied about these factors in the previous lesson the components of the ecosystem are seen to function as a unit when you consider the following aspects 1 productivity 2 decomposition 3 energy flow and 4 nutrient cycling structure and functions of pond ecosystem a freshwater pond is a classical example of an ecosystem to understand the structure and functions of an ecosystem the structure of a pond ecosystem show abiotic and biotic components pond is a shallow water body in which productivity decomposition energy flow and nutrient cycling are well exhibited it is a self-sustainable unit and simple ecosystem structure of the pond ecosystem the structure of the pond ecosystem comprises with abiotic and biotic components the abiotic component is the water with all the dissolved inorganic and organic substances and the rich soil deposit at the bottom of the pond abiotic component the abiotic components of pond ecosystem includes a water and dissolved gases and minerals and suspended organic matter b soil at the bottom with its minerals and organic debris c air above the surface of water containing free carbon dioxide and oxygen d sunlight the abiotic environment provides raw materials and energy to the producers and habitat to all the organisms.